So if you're watching this, um, I'm gonna show you how to edit my videos. So here's the little subscribe thing. Make sure to subscribe if you guys are new. <laughs> Let's just pretend I'm talking about something articulate and then I say what I wanna say and I prove my point. Also, when I say something important, I kinda zoom into my face like this. Look at my hand. Isn't that funny? <laughs> Hey guys, look, I have a big mouth. Do I look cool now? I will see you guys next time I upload. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, this is the channel called Tub2, but I changed it to Birdie just because it's a more personal channel. That's literally it. There's nothing more to say. Um, but anyway, it's me, Tub. And today I'm going to show you guys how I edit my videos. Uh, I use a program called Vegas Pro 18. There are a bunch of Vegas Pros, but 18 works the best for me. This program costs about like 400 bucks, I think. Uh, you can download it illegally. I'm not saying that's what I did. I'm not condoning it, but I'm just letting you know that that's a possibility. <laughs> anyway, uh, so let me quickly explain. I already filmed this video and it took like 20 minutes to make it because I was making it on the spot and I, it was just not a good video. But now I have an actual file that I'm just gonna go through and we're gonna go through it together. So how I edit my videos, it's right here. So for this example, I'm gonna show you guys a little fake video, what is this, 30 seconds that I made uh, where I show off the basic edits that I always do. So the first thing I did was, well, I changed my microphone. Um, I'll, I can show you this one live. So when I first drag in my, uh, my video, because this is my webcam, I mean not webcam, my freaking, my camera. It comes with audio, as camera should. But I like to use my other mic because it's better. So we sync it up. And in my videos I do this. Let me just um, move this one here. Three, two, one, sync. That's to sync up the audio. So how we do that is we line it up as best we can, and then we go to the clap. So right when my hands come in contact, that's when we sync it up. And in case you're wondering, the audio is not already sunk up with this. Like it, it tries its best, but it's just, we could do better. That's what I'm trying to say. And we drag this up, but as you can see, they're still um, loose. They're, they're not grouped together. So we click this, we click this, and then we click G. In case you're wondering how we ungrouped it, you click U. Again, it's ungrouped. So we're gonna control click, group. There you go. Now it's sunk up. Three, two, one, sync. Boom. So it's sunk up. But as you can see on these clips, the final versions, ah, the lighting is way better. So what we, what we did there is we added a um, preset. So this is the regular lighting. Ew, gross. And I I added one called Hue Sap Bright. It's in these effects. Uh, these are the regular Vegas ones, but I downloaded some third-party ones. The reason these have S like before them or S's before them is because they are third party. Uh, they did not come with Vegas. Um, they're called Sapphire plugins for Vegas Pro, something like that. Uh, again, you can download these illegally. Not condoning you do that, but it's a possibility. So I used one called Hue Sap Bright. I already have it right here. Uh, let's click cancel. So it's right here, Hue Sap Bright. And I have presets. So I have video two. Uh, that one looks too bright. So I went with my video one. And you can copy that if you really want to. And also another thing I did for my microphone is here, let me show you guys. Uh, so every time these three are always automatically like effect, these are effects that are always automatically added into your tracks. You could use them, you cannot, uh, just keep them on you know, for the most part. Um, I add, I have, a, I have a specific preset for track EQ and it's called Tuv. Let's remove it and let's see how the audio sounds. So if you're watching this, um, I'm, gonna show you how to edit my videos so let's add it so if you're watching this um, I'm gonna show you how to edit my videos so it sounds better it's like crispier so when you do when you edit the effects here like on this little side it edits them for all these in the in the layer you can edit them individually but that's gonna take forever anyway that's what we have. So we also have our background music. We have our music in the background. As you can see, let's solo it out. Let me just calm, drag it in. Um, I turned this a little bit up because this is how it is normal. Like go to zero or zero. Like that. 
So if you're watching this, um, I'm I turn it up. gonna show you how to edit my videos. So here's the little subscribe thing. Make sure to subscribe if you guys. Okay, so the subscribe thing. This is something that I bought on a website called Creator Set. Um, I forgot how much it was. I think five to $10, something around that. And so the first thing, when you get the clip, let's just uh, reset it. This is how it's gonna look like. So you're gonna have to edit it. Make sure this is on top because it's like, it's a layer on top of a layer. If you put it under, then it won't make sense. You know, it's not even gonna show up. So first thing you do is you're gonna chroma key. Let's start from the beginning. Third party, oh no, Vegas. Go to Vegas chroma key right there. Um, and then I have a preset called banner. So let's go to YouTube banner, but I'm gonna show you guys how to do it just from the beginning. So what I do is I uncheck it first, click this, click the eyedropper and get the color. There you go. You just, and I'll make a preset. <laughs> so have it for later. And then you click this little event pan crop. We're gonna click, oh, you, I have a preset. I'm not gonna use a preset for you guys. Match output aspect. Click this twice so you could uh, drag it in the Y. I guess that's how you say it. Drag it to wherever you want. Oh, here's the little subscribe thing. Make sure to subscribe if you guys are new. <laughs> Let's just pretend I'm talking about something. There you go. But I have a preset. It's called IG banner. That gets a little bit smaller. I have one for Instagram. That's why it's called that. To save your project, you click this right here. Um, it's going to ask you to name your file. Just name it. I already named mine. <laughs> Let's just pretend I'm talking about something. Oh, by the way, we can turn this to draft so it's like a lot smoother. That's why it's a little bit laggy because it's like giving us the HD preview. <laughs> Let's just pretend I'm talking about something articulate and then I say what I want to say and I prove my point. Also, when I say something important, I kind of zoom into my face like this. Look. All right. So for this segment here, let me highlight it. I was just showing you guys how I cut my clips. As you can see, it's not a smooth video. I cut it because I'm awkward for the most part. Look, let's show you guys what I'm doing. I'm just thinking, see? So what we do is we cut it and we put it back. Uh, it's a little bit unsunk, there you go. And then I say cut. what I wanna say and I prove my point. Cut. Also, when I say something important, I kinda zoom into my face like this. Look. Um, okay, so now we go to the zoom in. As you can see, I removed the audio track or the freaking background music because it just adds like, like I want you guys to focus on what I say, you know? Uh, makes it more dramatic, I guess? I don't know what to, what to say. Um, so to zoom in literally, so you're going to start off with a clip like this to zoom in. You just grab this. Oh, let, let's take this off. You grab this and you go a little bit closer and you line it up with, I just line it up with my nose. That's how I always do it. But I have an effect where it looks like the camera's moving. Watch. I kind of zoom into my face like this. Look at, I don't know if you guys noticed, but that effect is called S shake. Uh, the, again, this is a like uh, third party, so you would have to like download this from another website. So I have it as calm. You can copy that if you want. Zoom into my face like this. Look at my hand. Isn't that funny? <laughs> All right, so I feel like I'm showing you guys like a Minecraft texture pack where you walk around and show everyone like a different block. <laughs> so anyway, look at my hand. So for this, I want to show you guys the tracking movement of my hand. The way we do that is you have to, okay, so on your first frame, so go to sync cursor, because right now you're gonna want this to be sunk up. Go to the very first point of your video, the zero second part, and zoom into wherever you want. And if you guys keep moving forward, as you can see, it's trying to follow my hand. The easy way to do this is I just go like every 10 seconds. So every 10 seconds, just keep putting it on your hand. Uh, this is basically, at that point in the video, it's gonna be on your hand. So you're creating tracking just every 10 seconds or milliseconds, I don't know how to say that. And then right here, it like, uh, my hand's going down. So I bring my hand down. I don't go past the border because you can see there's black. I don't do that. So we just leave it at the most. And then here, I just go back. So from this, it's gonna just animate itself. And the sounds, I got these sounds from YouTube. You guys could do it too. It's just to add a little effect here. Let's remove the the audio just so it sounds better. My hand. Isn't that funny? <laughs> okay, I forgot I even edited that. Okay, so there are some points in my videos where I do like a little funny edit where I'm screaming or something. So for this, we have 
a um, little bit of everything. So the brightness, I just put that up. I put the saturation all the way up. You don't have to, but I put it all the way up. Uh, the S shake. So the S, this is like the funny, like how it's moving fast, the camera. Here, let's uh, turn this down now. The camera moving fast, because without it, uh, it would look kind of boring. See? The camera moving is what adds it. So I have it as funny rage. You guys can copy that. Uh, brightness, I just, you know, like deep fried meme. I you could put it like that. I don't care. Oh, that looks awkward. I didn't. There you go. And then here I wanted to show you guys how I speed up my clips. So basically, to speed up a clip, you hold control and then you just squeeze it. Or you can make it, same thing with like to make it slow motion, but I have it right here sped up. <laughs> hey guys, look. I, uh, yeah, so this is just like a non-copyright track off YouTube. Um, and then the mouth part, this is a pretty cool edit. Hey guys, look, I have a big mouth. Do I look cool now? I will. Um, the way you do this is you ungroup your your uh, main video from your audio. So you ungroup it, you control C, control V and put it on top. Now you have a layer on top of it. So what we did is we masked out my mouth. You see every frame, oh not frame, like every, again, every like few seconds, I just go in and I slightly move it. But for this, we use the circle and we just outline my mouth like that, but we don't need a second one. And but for this to make it like look even better, you go to feather type and you put both. Okay, so it's gonna be on none and you put both. And put this to the level two, the feather percent. Uh, two works really good. As you can see, it like blends in. That's what I like about it. Hey guys, look, I have. So just to make it, just to tell you, like show you guys how it works. Hey guys, look, I have a big mouth. Do I look cool? Oh, the way I made it bigger, by the way, is you go to the position right here. And I just, here, let's go to, from the top. I can make it even bigger if I wanted to, you know, but uh, let's go back. You, you, you can do whatever you want. You could change the size. Do I look cool now? I will see you guys next time I upload. Yeah, I also my outro. I will see you guys next time I upload. Yeah, so my outro is already made. It's literally just the no signal thing mixed in with a white screen and then whatever song I want, you know, non-copyright song, so I won't get a copyright claim. And if you're wondering what this is, I just added this in because it, it cuts to black. I have to fix that on my own time, so I had to fill it in. I do that for every video. <laughs> I really got to fix that. Anyway, sorry if this seemed rushed. I don't really think it was, but if I missed anything, if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. I'll try my best to answer it, but I'm thinking about making an update video with if you guys ask specific questions and I'll just answer them. If you guys don't know how I edit, go watch my videos and you'll see how I edit. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time I upload.